to take him down. Can you do it quietly? What's with that mumbling? Sitting there. We must get out before they are covered. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go. All unauthorized. Who are you? Andrei Ivanovich Yermak, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar, then God willing, I'll get you out of here. So I have get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. Hey. 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 Artyom, I see the enemy. <sighs> Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. 
Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Artyom, incoming, two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. from behind the gate. There's nobody out there, that's for sure. It's the outside gate, so it could only be watchmen. What if it's the attackers? Well, then those watchmen just have a nice meal and we don't have to worry. <laughs> you say so. Still, this is suspicious. You do your thing and I'll just stay here, just in case.
Point to the generator room. Aha, uh -huh. nothing left to hand. No need to play heroes for a change. Let's wait till they walk off. Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Jim. turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We can easily have the whole base on us. Turn the turntable on. Intense. 
Are you okay? Hey, there's a manual drive on the platform. It's hard to Adi drive. together. just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to it's not my this call, and you know misunderstanding. Well, I'll channel. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. There's no one behind. It's not all right, Spartans, throw these overboard and full steam ahead! Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch the mare. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. 
But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone! The whole fucking world! And not even batting an eye!
Artyom, place the bomb as close to the boiler as you can. Top shot! Top shot! I'm with the stopper! I'm not with this! They made me! Just go on for from you, but you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something at least! You owe us that! Well... I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs so that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, Alan before Artyom took that radio that outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago under a strict you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. And look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. <sighs> Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There is no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command! What are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for me? Wait a minute, what was that? Speaking from the Ark Project base. Everyone who can hear me, everyone still loyal to the cause. Listen, everyone! Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code 18. One, one, dash, seven, nine. Area, right. one, eight, dash, five. I repeat, proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code one. 
So it is somewhere around here. The Yamantown Mountain. So the solution is here to go like this. This is our goal. So is this what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change, everything. Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, by the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a short trip to the Euros, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time! Let's go around and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell! <laughs> Even better! Oh, come How about on! Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? That's better! <laughs> Not bad, I like it! Ah, beautiful name! Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later! Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's drink to the Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round that should be enough. Yermak, full steam ahead. Hi. Uh, full oh, steam ahead. Uh, we wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. Oh, Anna. I was expecting an arrow from a kid, but I got a bullet from an ugly motherfucker instead. <laughs> <laughs> you sure you're okay? Because I know you. Just so you know, scars attract the ladies. And there's definitely a lot of those up ahead. I don't need a lot, really. Can you feel how sweet the air is without a mask? Or not just sweet, so many shades of tears in the Andrei Ivanovich, how long have you been working with those jammer people for? About a year, I guess. At first they got me to sign up. Anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Shots fired! Four bogies on a trolley! Oha! Report to the bridge! On the double! 
Are you all right, Artyom? They pierced the cylinder. How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck. Oh, shit. Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could have put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that bridge. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. Yeah, I go with Artyom too. As backup. No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Your Let's back. go, Artyom. When can you get the Aurora running again? Yeah, I don't know yet. They gotta check on that cylinder, but a full day at least. I see. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Maybe they served the enemy, enslaved or something. Going down. Great. Hey, what was that? Could you check it out? That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. Look, a rabbit! A boat. You won't have to go swimming after all. The locals probably get around mainly by boats. Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. Oh, looks like you've been spotted. 
Jump, there's a woman on that bell tower waving a rag or something. Please investigate. I see people at the church. None seem to be armed. We'd better try the open approach. Let's not fire first, okay? Our father, Salantius, has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. We are a peaceful lot, so please keep your weapons sheathed and welcome. won't even talk to heretics. But I'll tell you everything I've seen Let's in this jump. place all a that year. Arriving under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silentia has fooled them just like the locals. But unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us. Artyom, she's right. Get to the boat. We will rescue her later. Don't worry. Go! Nasty and I can get to your place. by boat during the sermon. And then what? Well, he, he was just there and then he kind of disappeared. Well, you thought Father Celestia said the man was sent by the devil. Yeah, I know. I know what Father said. Tell me if you saw where you wish. Protect me. Artyom, I can't cover you when you're inside. I'm changing position to meet the woman and child. I know you can handle this just fine. Here after all. We have to find him, my well, children. That's even better. Um, have you seen the heretic, sister? Of course I did that heathen. So you have seen him? They can't even walk at Are you alright? A shame you couldn't get away quick. 
quietly, without bloodshed. They're bound to hate us even more now. Ah oh, well. Artyom, Katya, and Nastya are with me now. See you aboard the Aurora. Check the map. Looks like you can row straight to it from there. What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! The old man sent me out as a forward sentry. Told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And so you subdue the occupation forces peacefully with a holy cross and a prayer. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing you. Artyom, back from the abyss of NATO You're occupation. alive! 
Impressive after the horrors Duke told us about. Let's go. Dad's talking to Katya right now. They are so nice. Both Katya and her daughter. And Katya's medical training will come in handy. Thank you for the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artem, a moment. Artem, stop by my desk once you're done talking to the old man. I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artem. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we are to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yeramak can't handle the repairs alone. So, once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge.